Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Shadow. Today I will re review the Hunter FE. I finally got my hands on it. So the Hunter FE, it's a tier 9 armor fighting vehicle. You can get it from the Enigma Battle Path skin that is currently running right now. You need battle coins to buy the crates. You will need to gather 100 parts to assemble the Hunter FV. So, what retrofits do I use? I used improved barrel lining. If you don't have the barrel lining unlocked, you can go with the Gun Breach version 2. I use increased hull traverse for more uh, mobility. I use improved filter system version 2 for more acceleration on the engine and argument optics version 2 for more revenge and this build is more around uh, playing the hunter fb like a support or fighting tank what modification do i have on it i'm using the 30 millimeter lr2 the difference is that the lr2 fire both missiles really fast compared to the 30 millimeter lr only shooting one missile at a time where there's a delay between the next missiles around two or three seconds but i'm going for the uh, lr2 because of the damage per minute you can dish out pretty fast and also the lr2 has the improved recon package it's helpful to extend your revenge when you're stationary what is the armor on the hand hunter afv Low plate is a weak point, it's only 100 millimeters. Everything will go through the lower plate. Upper plate is a lot stronger, that is where the NERA package is. It can bounce all odd cannon shells fired at it with AP rounds, but main battle tanks and tank destroyers with missiles and light tanks can penetrate it. Turret on the Hunter FV is on man turret that means when you're shooting at the turret you will do little damage to it ammo types it has pale rounds it can pin a lot of tanks in front if you can hit flat surface on tanks it deals 30 damage per shell penetration of 130 it also has AP rounds they have a damage of 38 per shell, penetration of 192, missiles, they can deal over 820 damage and has penetration of uh, 1000. So what do I think of the anti -FV? Well I'll say that it's more effective than the S21 just because the Hunter FV don't have Javelin missiles. Guided missiles is better, in my opinion. They have the same playstyle. Hunter AFV is not. A, I hope this review helped you guys to build your Hunter AFV. And thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.